Age UK Northumberland is an independent charity supporting the older people of Northumberland. Anybody over 50 is eligible to be supported by ourselves. Over the last 12 months, we've really seen that the friendship groups have developed significantly. There's been an awful lot more people coming back out, which has been fantastic. Cuddling, going out and about and doing social activities. And it's nice to be able to actually see that we've been able to widen our geography, particularly over that period. We offer a range of services to help people over the age of 50 to live their best life. We can provide information and advice supporting people with welfare benefits or helping them review their housing options. We have bereavement counselling, advocates who help people to have their voice heard. We run lots and lots of health and wellbeing classes, social groups and also a friendship line for people in order to tackle loneliness and isolation. We've also found some challenges over that time as well. Obviously funding has increasingly become difficult to be able to access. One of the common perceptions with regards to AGK Northumberland is that we are government funded and we're not. We have to go and seek independent funding for everything that we achieve. And what we're seeking to do over the coming years is sustainability. And then when it comes to doing um, the care aspect of our organisation, access to staff has also been an issue. We're really proud of the staff that we have here at Age UK. They do an amazing job within the community and they're absolutely fantastic. We provide services personalised to each individual, meals, personal care, showers, enablings, medications, sitting services, shopping, domestic, really whatever that individual needs and what preferences they have. We help with welfare benefits, the application processes, travel applications, housing applications, anything that people need a hand with. A lot of them to do with, with benefits and wanting to know whether they're benefits, but also families who are ringing up on behalf of their parents, their elderly parents, who are looking suddenly now for questions to be answered with regard to accommodation, future needs, how to access support. And we will help with a range of issues. We won't just help them with one thing, leave them to it. We'll stay with them and they'll be our clients for you know a number of months until we've resolved everything that they need a hand with. The big thing that gives us job satisfaction is we have a lot of returning clients and people that will help then for years. My role within the advocacy service is to help people have a voice. Sometimes we're asked to step in um, to support people to attend appointments or understand diagnoses or even challenge a decision, for example um, a benefit decision. The Friendship Line is a wonderful service. We match volunteers with lonely and isolated people. I think the difference this makes to them is that they have something to look forward to once a week. Outside of the Friendship Line call, the only other interaction they might have with people is with carers or hospital appointments. We aim to combat social isolation, loneliness. They perhaps don't see people all week. They perhaps families that live quite a distance away. I volunteer with Age UK Northumberland and I come here once a week. I realise that I am able to be a part of this group and identify where perhaps more support might may be needed. I would definitely recommend people coming to the group because I've got loads out of it. I've been here um, since it first started. We enjoy it very much, we look forward to it. We have days out. Loneliness can affect a lot of people. You might not talk to anybody for a week. We have games and everything, I enjoy it. And we really look forward to coming here and feel a lot better afterwards. If somebody was thinking about coming here, I would say just come. We all need each other, you know. There's always somebody to talk to. We'll always get a nice cup of tea and a warm welcome. Our dementia groups have been running for over three years and help to improve memory, mood and movement. It's all about social interaction, having fun and having a bit of a laugh. I support a team of health and wellbeing officers and exercise volunteers. Exercise is so important for your wellbeing and for your everyday life. It makes things so easy to do if you're physically fit and delivering the classes is amazing and people coming back to me after the sessions and saying, this is really working for me. I've seen a big difference in the improvement in my health.
Before I started my role as social media assistant, I helped our fantastic volunteer coordinator in admin. It was a fantastic experience and it gave me so much confidence. I just love working here, it's fantastic. During this year, we've supported over 4,500 people through a diverse range of services. We've worked with people through our veterans coordinator. We have a scams awareness project, services to support carers looking after people who are living with dementia. We have around 200 support workers within the home care department. The area we cover is anywhere from Holtwistle, Hexham, Ashton, Morpeth, Rothbury, Annick, all the surrounding areas. The home care team makes a massive difference within Northumberland. They enable people to be in their homes, which is what we're about. The customers are the most important people that will provide a service to, we want the service to be right for them. It's a valued service, we promote everybody's independence, you know, that's the most important thing around home care and the needs of the individuals and that's what we're based on. I went into home care because I like people and you do a variety of work. I've always cared for people all my life, even before I went into home care. It's never the same every day or every house, everything's different. I feel like I can support individuals with competence, independence and giving a friendly face. Well, the best bit about my job is that I actually enjoy going to work. <laughs> I do, I enjoy going to work. This charity listens to what its people want, to what it is that they want us to do, how they want us to develop and what our services are. And that's seen as to be able to mould various projects that we're working on. Moving with the times and becoming slightly more modern with the way that we deal with things, we employ the best people. I am so proud of everybody that we employ in this organisation. Every role we do makes a difference to ensure that people live the best lives. I truly believe we're a caring organisation and everything that we do is about caring for the people that we support and each other. Right in here, every single person cares. And it's the one thing I'm passionate that we build that caring community. The people within AGK Northumberland are looking at how that they can make a difference to people's lives. Last year, we completed over 450,000 care calls. AGK Northumberland have over 80 volunteers. We have eight weekly social groups across Northumberland supported by volunteers. We're always looking for volunteers to take part in our projects, no matter how much or how little time you've got to give. Our information and advice team helped people to access over £1.5 million in additional benefits last year. Our advocacy team last year helped over 80 clients with tribunals, appeals and making their wishes heard. We have over 20 friendship volunteers who call their clients on a weekly basis just for a chat and to provide support. We have over 30 fitness classes running across the county of Northumberland. More than 20% of our staff have worked for us for more than 10 years. I worked as a volunteer for four years before applying for this role. Our case managers have a combined working age of 863 years. 